Welcome to Excel Magic Trick number 1018. Hey, if you want to download this workbook 1017 and 1020, click on the link below the video. Hey, this video we want to see how to use the ceiling function. So we have a cash budget here, and here's our ending cash uh, amount for each month. We have a minimum requirement of 8,000. So for this line, we have to figure out how much to borrow. So here, Obviously, we ended up with a minus number here, so we're going to need to borrow that as a positive number plus this 8,000. So instead of typing an equal sign, I'm going to type a minus sign. By the way, the minus sign and the plus sign serve as equal signs, which instruct Excel to uh, create a formula. And I'm going to click on that cell, and I'm simply going to add it to the 8,000 and hit the F4 key to lock it. Control Enter and copy it. So if we could borrow in any increments, then that would be fine, but it's not. We need to round this up, round this up. This one's ridiculous. We'll deal with that in a second. But we need to round these up to the $1,000. So we're simply going to use the ceiling function. 2010, they added ceiling math. This has an extra argument that treats negative numbers differently. We don't need that. We'll use the old compatibility function. That's what that little triangle means, the old standby comma, and significance, hey, there's our 1,000 F4 to lock it. Close parentheses, Control Enter. That's our amount we need. Copy it over. Now we want to turn this to a 0, so we're simply going to add a simple logical test. If this number right here is greater than our 8,000 F4, then what do we want? A 0. Otherwise, run the ceiling. Control Enter and copy it over. Now let's test this. Let's come right here, and I know there's a formula there, but let's just type uh, 8,000, 7,099. Ooh, that would be a bummer. I'd take the $1 right out of my pocket instead of going and borrowing a 1,000, although that might be called obfuscation, I guess, in accounting. All right, Control-Z, Control-Z. All right, a little bit about the ceiling function. And if, we'll see you next video.